Good morning, Willard Wildcats. Happy Friday, January 8th. We have birthdays to celebrate today and this weekend. Happy birthday to Giovanni L. and Susana R.C. Happy birthday this weekend to Clarissa L. Sergio C. and Kingston E. We hope you have wonderful birthdays today and this weekend. I wanna thank Mrs. Ware who taught me the sign language word for empathy. So when we do this motion, this is the ASL sign for empathy. And today we're gonna to read a book because remember empathy is we're talking about that in this month of January and building this IB attitude. And we're gonna read a book called Dreamers by Yuri Morales. And this book helps us understand and gives us empathy which means we have compassion for the thoughts and feelings of others about what it's like to be new somewhere. So this beautiful book begins and it says, dreamers, look at how beautiful that illustration is. I dreamed of you, then you appeared. Together we became amor, love, amor, resplendent life, you and I. One day we bundled gifts in our backpack and crossed a bridge outstretched like the universe. And it says, adios corazon. And when we made it to the other side, thirsty in awe, unable to go back, we became immigrants. Migrantes, you and I, the sky and the land welcomed us in words unlike those of our ancestors. And it says, give thanks. And you'll notice in this picture, there's a picture of a bookstore. That's some foreshadowing. That's something that's gonna come up again in this book. There were so many things we didn't know, unable to understand and afraid to speak. We made lots of mistakes. So when you're new to a new country, you might not speak the language, right? And that's when we need to have empathy for those that are learning our language. And also, it's so important to know more than one language. And that's something we really value. At Willard, we're an IB school and we value the importance of world languages. You and I became caminantes. Thousands and thousands of steps we took around this land until the day we found... What do you think they're gonna find? I already gave you a hint. A place we had never be seen, seen, we had never seen before. Improbable. Improbable. Unbelievable, surprising. What is it? It's a library. Unimaginable. Look at all of the places you go when you read a book. We didn't know, where we didn't need to speak, we only needed to trust and we did. The more you read, the more you learn, right? Books became our language, books became our home, books became our lives, we learned to read. To speak, to write, and to make our voices heard. The power of books. Someday we will become something we haven't yet imagined. But right now, we are stories. We are two languages. We are lucha. We are resilience. We are hope. We are dreamers. Sonadores of the world. We are love, amor, love. What a powerful message. So I want you to think about that and empathy. And maybe when somebody is new to your class, do you have that empathy for them? And do you show them compassion, kindness, caring, and love? And remember, we all have stories to tell and books help us learn more and they help us imagine what we couldn't even yet imagine. That's why I love this book, Dreamers. Wildcats, remember we are safe, respectful, and responsible. Have a wonderful day.